What is good everybody and welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we have My Damn Hauls episode number 21. We have three packages here today. If you do not know what My Damn Hauls is, it is the video series where I take all of the mail I receive that have WWE figures, any figures I pick up at retail, any figures I pick up from eBay and so forth and I put them on camera to show you guys. So right here, like I said, we have three packages, all trades, I believe, from my followers on Instagram, and I believe one of my good friends, hey Zeus. So we will get into these packages. We only have three. I cannot remember. I remember what hey Zeus is sending, but I cannot remember what is on these two. So I will be just as surprised as you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. Real quick, guys, before we get into the packages, I want to give a huge shout-out to my boy, Venom Mine Figs. I will leave a link in the description below for you to go check his channel out. Big friend of mine, awesome guy, awesome YouTuber. Go check him out, but he sent me these crowd signs for my PickFed Arena and, you know, my WWE figure arena. So I want to give a huge shout-out to him and show you the work that he did for me. First up, we have this Kenny Omega sign that looks awesome. That is for Kenny Omega on Vindication. Up next, we have the best sign, I think, and that is the MDT Live Greater Than Vindication sign right here. And you already know what it is. MDT Live always crushing Vindication in the ratings. Next up, we have this RIP Finn. This obviously is tying into the storyline between Kenny Omega and Finn Balor. Got the Finn Balor head right there. Really awesome job by Venomon. Next, we have a really simple one, but a really awesome one. The Too Sweet there with a Too Sweet hand gesture. Really cool sign there. Next up, we have the Extreme Champion RVD represented in the crowd right there. We have a Venomon fig sign. Gotta always rep my boy in the crowd. So, again, go check out his channel. Next, we have this Trash Corbin sign, and this one's awesome because I actually made this one in real life. Me and Face Wife took this sign to SmackDown Live, so really awesome sign there. Next up, we have a Bullet Club sign that he took the time to redo for me because he didn't do the best job the first time around, and he totally killed it with the second time. So great job by Venomine there. And next, we have this Shardimus Prime sign, and we got Big Time Let Down Spider-Man right there. Um, if you don't know who that is, go check him out. Very amazing YouTuber. One of my favorite YouTubers out there right now. Next up, we have this Photoshop image of Braun Strowman in this Iron Man helmet and I did that myself and then I just got him to uh, print it off and obviously I did this because Braun Strowman is the Iron Man champion and the last sign we have right here is this Rated R logo for Edge on MDT Live. So that is all those signs. Thanks again bro, you are the best. But now let's get into these packages. Alright guys, well I totally butchered that take on accident, but it is this TNF Rollins is the first package, and it is from Joey Ellington, I believe that's what the package said before I scribbled over it, I cannot see now. So that's why you want to make sure you know what you're talking about before you record a take. However, I'm so happy to pick up this TNF Rollins, I've already gotten my use out of it, but um, the time you guys are seeing this video... You have already seen the custom that I made from it, so I guess I can go ahead and show you guys. Um, this is the Rollins that I ended up making with it. I was going to make it a Spider-Man attire, but it ended up, um, I ended up loving the way the blue and the gray and black mixed together. So I just went ahead and went with that, and I totally love the way it came out. But now I can use this other TNF Rollins to make a different attire or something like that. So thank you to Joey. We are moving on to the next package. The next package we have, guys, right here is from my boy Hey Zeus Customs on Instagram. Hey Zeus is a great friend of mine, fellow Cena fan as well, and he is just an amazing person. I believe he won the Dammy Award for uh, Most Improved this year. So he is just an awesome friend and a great um, figure collector in the community, and I just love all the stuff he posts. But as we open up the box right here, there should be two figures in here, and they are both really, really awesome. I needed them for customs, and he totally hooked me up. We made a great deal, and as you will see as I open this up, the first figure we have right here is this Elite 20 Cody Rhodes, and if you are a, you know, my damn Hall's freaking, um, I don't know, historian, you would know that this Elite 20 Cody Rhodes, or the Elite Cody Rhodes, has been featured on this uh, video series more than any other figure. It's been on here a hundred million times, I swear, um, just because of all the ballers and stuff that we have made. But the other figure is the Network Spotlight AJ Styles, and he threw in the white elbow pad, which is absolutely beautiful. So thank you so much to Jesus. These figures are awesome. I have big plans for both of these. So shout out to Jesus Customs again. I will leave a link in the description to his YouTube channel and his Instagram. And we are moving on to the final package on this episode. 
All right, guys, getting into the last package on this episode, I'm going to be completely real with you right here. I don't remember what's in here, and it feels like a lot of figures, and I don't remember making a deal, so I don't know really what this is. Um, I'm pretty excited, though, to find out. So it looks like he stuffed an envelope inside an envelope, so that is just awesome. Um, let's go ahead and rip open this and get that out of there so you guys um it says fragile on it but i guess the people at the mail office couldn't read that unless they read that and then threw it in another um thing but i'm ripping it open right here and now i completely remember what this is and this is from my boy rasslin post i believe on instagram um right here we have a little baggie with all of the accessories um, we have another baggie in here with the other figure, and then we have these three or four Cena's, I think. Yeah, it's four Cena's. Okay, so maybe, I could be wrong, maybe John Cena's the most featured uh, guy on uh, My Damn Halls, but the first figure we have right here is this Elite 34 John Cena fix-up. And um, let me go ahead and raise this up for you guys so you guys can see the full figure. But right here, the first one we have is this Elite 34 John Cena with the Elite 20 arms, I believe. Up next, we have the Elite 50 John Cena. And it's, you know, the blue, the red, white, and blue colorway right there. Next up, we have this Elite 46 John Cena. Going ahead and standing him up right here. If he'll go ahead and stand. And then the last figure we have right here. This is the own this is the second time I think I've owned this figure, so this is a really cool figure and I love the camo shorts and everything that goes with it. And that is the Elite 17, I believe John Cena. So, since this one took a plunge. All right, and then the rest of the stuff we have right here is this baggie which contains a Roman Reigns Elite so here it is, we have the Elite 45 Roman Reigns, we can slide everybody over, maybe we can get everybody in the frame, just like that. And then we have this little baggie right here, and it contains, let's see right here, we got some shirts, and then we have some hats, and then we have some other accessories that were part of our trade, which I will go through right now. Um, the biggest thing that I needed from this is the Jay Uso uh, bandana accessory, and then I got his hoodie as well. So I really needed that. Then we have the Elite 50 John Cena shirt, the Elite 34 John Cena shirt, and then we have the Elite 17 John Cena shirt. And we have three hats, I believe, or is it just two? Maybe it's just two. We got the Elite 46 and the Elite 50. So shout out to Rasslin Post. I will leave his a link to his Instagram below. He is a great Instagrammer as well for WWE figures. So let's get into the end of this video. All right, guys, well, this is everything that we picked up on this episode of My Damn Halls, if you include all of the Venomine signs that we got right here and the Jey Uso banner or bandana accessory right here. But this is a really successful haul. All of these things will go into the customs that I needed, and it will expand the John Cena collection. Shout out to everybody that I got packages from on this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like, comment down below what your favorite package or figure is from this haul. Sh uh, subscribe for more epic WWE and WWE figure related videos, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much.